Hey, sneaking in the next pack today. Yes, today we have Illumi. Yes, Illumi. And you're saying, nah, that looks a little bit weird, Sneaky. Well, it's not too weird. It's based on Debian 6, okay? But uses the ICE Windows Manager. So it's pretty super duper fast. I'm going to go through it with you. As you can see, it's really basic layout. We have Home, Web, Filer, Music, and Notes. Yes, notes. So should we click on notes and see what we get? And that's all you get. And I think this is leaf pad. Let's have a look. Yes, we have leaf pad for your notes or your simple text editing. Okay, we'll close them down. What music browser do we have? Let's have a look. We have Audacious for your music. Nice. Basic file system. Your web browser of choice today is uh, is iSape, which is you know nice, quick. Goes whoosh, 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 whoosh. As you can see. Looks like it's based from Malaysia. Hmm. So we don't want Google Malaysia, do we? No, we just have ordinary Google when it's time we have a look. So if I click on the BBC, make sure what comes up, go to the home page. Comes up nice, yes. I say works very, very well indeedy. Super fast, super duper. Okay, that's enough of that one. As you can see, the closed down menu is on the left hand side. I'm getting confused with all these different distros with the X on different sides and everything, man. Okay, on the bottom, you've got time, CPU, net. You have two workspaces. You can have up to many as you like, really, couldn't you, when you think about it. And a launch menu. Okay, we have about. So we click about and see what happens. There you go. About. Build preview 008. Visit the project's website. So you have a look. Let's go. Okay, we'll click about here. Who is it for? Bloody, bloody, blah, 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 blah. Yeah, it tells you all about it. So if you want to know about it, go and have a look yourself, okay? But I can tell you this, it does come with lots of stuff, and it's super, super fast. Only one drawback so far, I can't get it to install. And I'll show you in a minute why. So we're actually running from the live CD. But you get a nice full screen anyway, so that's nice for me. So under internet, you get your web browser, which is iSafe. You get Skype as standard. Hmm. You connect your Wi-Fi connections if you have one, and your firewall. Multimedia, you get music player, a video player, a picture viewer. An image editor, let's have a look what that is. It's Gimpy, of course. What else did you think it would be, for God's sake? There you go. Looks weird like that, doesn't it? It really does. Yeah, weirdo. Anyway, Gimpy works. Don't bet it's multimedia. You get a CD and DVD creator and a sound mixer. Under Office, you just get Abbey Word and G Numeric. A PDF reader, which is on this one. Doesn't actually say. Yes, it does. Have a look. It's just Document Viewer, okay? Just Document Viewer. Oh, that's all right, isn't it? Okay, back to the laundry again, because I want to show you as much of this as I can, really, because I don't think nobody else is going to do this one. Under office again. Oh, you also get a calendar. Don't forget about that. System, you get the terminal, your file manager, your task manager, a device manager, your power manager. Lots of managers. Too many managers, not enough Indians. Yeah, another calculator. All the same one. But you also get a little thing here with web apps. And this is really direct links to lots of web apps. So you get your Gmail, Google Docs, Google Maps, a dictionary, YouTube, Direct, Vimo as well, Facebook, Twitter, Flickr, and Amazon. Mmm, so they work, shall we? We click on the YouTube one, go straight to the tube, look, straight, straight, straight to the tube. So I'll click OK there, and I'll put me in here. And there is me, okay? Let's quickly go to my page, make sure it all works. We'll quickly run a video. Because Flash is actually pre-installed. Yes, unusually, it is pre-installed. There you go. Working nicely, nicely, and all that. Yeah, okay. That's enough for that. Yeah. Bye. See you later. Bye. So, Flash is pre-installed for you, so you can get most stuff to work. Okay. What else have you got in there? Facebook, yeah, I'll tunnel that. Programs, right. Now, this could be a long one, so I'm not going to go through them all. All right. Applications. Whoosh. Loads of stuff. So, I'll just go to Graphics. So, you get the GIMP and Windows Snapshot. And Office, as I said before, Abbey Word and Junior Merrick. It's not the latest Abbey Word, but nobody's using it yet anyway. Under Program, you get Python and TCL. What did I say? I did say that, no. Under Science, you get Mathematics. You get some calculators and stuff there. You different shells. Sound, you get an Elsa Mixer. Audacious, as we said before. And a no mouse Mixer as well. System again, Administration. Right, here we go. 
You get the Debian Task Manager at Tools which is the terminal thing, as you well know. You get Gparted for your partitioning. Yeah, Gparted. Remaster System Install, and this apparently is the only way to get it installed at the moment. So if they're going to do some more work on it, please get a proper installer. Because if I click on there, uh, wait, 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 wait. Oh, I forgot without waiting. It don't work basically, not for me anyway. Okay. So I'll go back to that one again. System administration, da 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 da. da. Can report a bug and stuff like that there as well. Under hardware, wireless drivers, Xvid tune. Okay, that's good for me. Monitoring, we've got top. You know what top is, isn't you? It's a bit like H top, but more basic. So we bring it down to the center, so you should be able to see it a bit more. And as you can see, we're not using nothing, really, are we? Nothing at all. Nothing, 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 nothing. So that's pretty cool by me. Right, unfortunately, because you can't install it, I can't give it a proper test out, which is a bit of a bummer, really. Yeah, I know. Now, under video, you get jigs in for your video things and viewers. Events, XDV view, and another image viewer. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Stuff like that. But under games, you just get a couple of clocks, and that's about it, really. You do get help and your screen stuff and window managers. You can change your windows here, do your workspaces, and stuff like that. Right. So, what do I think of this one? Well, I think it's a really good idea. Using this particular Windows Manager, it's going to be super fast, whatever you have it on, really. And you should be able to, when they get the installer done, you should be able to install it on near enough anything. And everything just works. So, guys, you really, 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 really need to get an installer done, please. But on the whole, it's a nice experience to use. It just works, and it's nice and fast, especially on new machines. But it, it should, in theory, go okay on old machines as well. Unfortunately, if you was going to have it on an old machine, say a laptop, not all of them come with a DVD drive, and the actual download is 900 odd meg. Bum, bum, bum. So that needs to be done as well, and addressed. Okay? On the whole, I'll give it a 4 out of 5, because it's so fast, and everything works off the disk, except for the installer. So get it done. Sneaky Linux out. I'll see you later. Bye-bye.